Uh, with UE games finally starting to trickle out, the rumoured specs of console refreshes and the upcoming Switch successor, do you think 2024 will be the year for pervasive ray tracing? Should it be an expectation for upcoming games like GTA? Uh, well, Oliver, we've kind of taken a look at the GTA trailer. It kind of suggests that that might be the case. Yeah, I mean, with GTA in particular, we kind of fingered um, RT Reflections and RTGI there, <laughs> basically, <laughs> okay. that title. Uh, in Sorry. terms of games in 2024, uh, yeah, I mean, I think so, because ray tracing is just such a great way to solve for lighting in games. I, I mean, I would personally expect most upcoming games over the next year or two to use at least one or two ray tracing Wait, techniques. Really? Or... Interesting. Uh, well, UE5 is going to be everywhere for starters, isn't it? Not everywhere, yeah. but yeah. I th UE5 titles, yes, will probably use those features. Yeah. But, uh, maybe like maybe among that. the upper tier of AAA, yes. maybe there's some, yeah, yeah. some dregs and still some like weird kind of cross-gen holdovers. But I mean, I would expect to see a ton of games ship with RT uh, over the next year or two. And in terms of the Switch 2... I'm less certain. Certainly some things will run on it in a performant way, at least we presume from the Matrix Awakens uh, demo and from uh, Rich's explorations of what comparable PC hardware can deliver. But in terms of matching the consoles in, in every game with the, the similar RT features, probably not. But but I expect that'll be a part of it as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, fair enough. Um, anything to add to that, John? No, not really. <laughs> no. Outside of okay. what I did. I mean, just I'm skeptical that I think RT is just so expensive still on these consoles. It just requires so much. Just, and when, well, it's a, it's thing a, is, if you're launching but, on Xbox, especially, and you got the Series S down there, it's, it can be well, pretty tough. Avatar to get that going. did it, you know. Yeah, but well. not everybody is uh, massive. Yeah, that's true. Fair <laughs> enough. We'll see, though. I, guess we, I hope we'll, it becomes we'll more common. I hope so. Mm -hmm, absolutely. I'm just very curious to see where Nvidia is going to go next with their stuff because you know that's sort of setting the trend for the ultra high end and we've seen some amazing stuff there so far so i'm hoping that there's going to be more there in 2024 also i'm really curious to see and this is completely off on a tangent here um alex talks about it last week that intel frame gen technology mm, right uh, how that actually shakes out 